Hey, all you cool cats and kittens. <laughs> God, Carol Baskin, man, I just can't help myself. Uh, <laughs> we're gonna do an oil change on Saturn. Um, a lot of people always complain about being able to get to the oil filter underneath the supercharger on the LSJ motor. It's really not that bad. Um, so since I'm doing an oil change, I figured I'd show you guys how I do it. Um, works out pretty good for me. So enjoy. So first things first, we're going to start with the tools we're going to use. We've got a 32 millimeter socket, universal joint swivel joint, swivel socket, whatever you want to call it, an extension, and then I've got an adapter so I can use just a standard like 3 8 ratchet on it. And to get to the oil filter, it's just, it's kind of like snaked in right here, so we're just going to drop the socket down right there, and then just kind of Fish it down till you get to the filter, and then it'll go right on, right on the cap. There we go. And that's all there is to it. So now I can use a ratchet, pop that on there, crank it off, and show you how to get get it up. That's off there. Right there. Now I'm just gonna reach in underneath the supercharger, grab the cap, tip it towards the front of the car. Oh, looks like the filter actually came off. So the cap's gonna come out by itself. Filters just down. It's just a cartridge filter. There we go. There's the filter. Normally, the filter comes with a replacement o-ring for the cap. I wouldn't necessarily say you have to replace it, but it comes with it. It's easy to do. You just replace it. So, and these little pick tools, super handy. You can get them real cheap. They're you know a couple bucks at like AutoZone or Harbor Freight or something. Come in super handy for that. Stuff. I recommend getting some. Alright, so now new o ring on, got the new filter. Just make sure it's not dirt or debris. And get all the debris off the threads there. Um, and then new filter snaps in. Make sure you got it on there. Cap has 25 newton meters for your torque setting, and I use that every time too. So I, don't know, I think people are just freaking crazy. But you just fish this in from the intake side, and then come back and go under, and then it should drop, drop right in. 
and then I just insert the threads. So that's good. And then we just take the socket, fish that back in again. Grab a torque wrench. Set this to 25 Newton meters. That's 24. Which equates to about 222 inch pounds. So that's what, like 12, 13 foot pounds, something like that. So, not a lot, but what it takes. Snug this up. There it is, 25 newton meters. And that's all there is to it. And then after that, it's just drain the oil, put new oil in, and good to go.